Chelsea, as we know, Taylor Harris has been a feature player of the competition across its three and a bit years so far. And last year, Michael Wilson from AFL Photos captured a moment in time, that spectacular kick here showing her supreme athleticism in the Pride match against the Bulldogs, of course. There was a lot of commentary coming off, particularly in terms of the social media reaction to that photo. Taylor Harris, one year on, reflecting on that moment. Harris with that very familiar approach and that very familiar finish. The emotions I felt when the kicking photo came up online, initially I thought, oh, it's a cool photo. I understand photography a little bit and I thought, oh, wow, the, the contrast and the colours and stuff are great. The Pride jersey was in there, so it really like popped and everything. And then obviously what happened next was all the comments below, which were... Um, yeah, obviously sexist and derogatory and everything like that. So reading them was when I went back up to the photo and I was like, what, what could, how can this be the comments? Like this seems to be the wrong fit, these comments to this photo. I realised that not only I would see those gross comments and they didn't affect me really at all, but I, the first thing I thought was my parents are going to see them. So that was pretty much what I thought the ripple effect of those comments was going to be. I can see in people's profile pictures that may have said something, they've got kids or they've got daughters or women in their photos even, and that is the stuff that I'm worried about. So perhaps this is an issue that might even have to go further. I think it was important to call out the trolling and the people who were trying to bring down women's sport, trying to bring down female athletes or athletes in general. Whether it was me kicking the footy or any other player, I was just really happy that this issue was brought to light. It's pathetic and I was always going to call it out and I was always going to stand up for myself against things people were saying. We're going to start with a sports story which started over in Australia but is making headlines around the world involving an athlete simply doing her day job. When the kick photo took off and a lot of people were really showing support for not only me but for the situation against trolling and sharing their own stories I felt really humbled and I felt like I would definitely did the right thing. People with really strong credibility were backing me up and then obviously internationally it went on CNN and then it was in other languages on Twitter and things so it was pretty wild. For what it became was a massive surprise. I didn't know it would go all over the world in the end. A famous airborne kick from AFLW star Taylor Harris has now been immortalised in a bronze statue. Harris hopes it represents more than just a great kick but also a broader message about standing up to bullying. I've said it plenty of times, whether, whether it was me or not, whether it was faceless, the statue, it's all about the messaging around it. It just happens to be um, the image that people can relate to what happened in the situation. One of my coaches did say to me that the only people that can bring you down are below you. People who try and drag you down aren't the ones that you're aspiring to be like. They're the ones that are nowhere near you. So yeah, I felt really, really powerful in that moment and that I'd made the right decision in calling it out.